Okay, greetings my YouTube and Facebook friends. Those who know me know that I'm a watchman. I'm always on the watch for what's going on to warn the flock, God's children, and what's happening in the world. Came across a headline that read, The EU can't survive in the current form anymore. They're looking for a leader to lead the whole shebang uh, within the next 18 months or two years or so. Then my brother Donnie, a buddy of mine from Facebook, shared something below with me. Start to dig further, I'm going to give you what I believe are the two potential possible scenarios for the Antichrist one world government. First of all, in Sweden, President Obama complained that the way he's treated here back home in the, in the U.S. said he would be more welcome in Europe. He said that if he was in Europe, if he was the leader in Europe or the leader of the EU, is where he's getting at, that he would be probably right of the middle, maybe a little bit left in the middle, but right in the middle, and all the countries would support him. My brother Nani shared that with me. Started doing some more digging after that. Here's what I came up with. First of all, Obama told the EU that he is trying to pattern the U.S. after the EU. He told them that just a few months ago. Since 2010, Obama has been the unofficial president of the EU. You heard me right. According to sources within the EU, EU's president hasn't been able to get individual nations to cooperate with his agenda, but Obama behind the scenes has gotten everyone to follow Obama's advice. Also, starting in 2009, several articles officially named Obama president of the world. Got that one world leader. The Antichrist won't be revealed, we know that, to the whole world until after the imminent rapture. They become Satan incarnate. However, the Bible also tells those with discernment to look for a man whose name is a number, and that number is 666. I've found a man who matches that. His name is Barack Hussein Obama. I'm going to piggyback my other video. There's other potential scenario besides this one, and I'm also going to piggyback all the scripture that proves uh, the video I did that's got like 850,000 views, the most exhaustive commentary on Obama being the Antichrist, the most proof anywhere from the Bible. I'm linking that below this video as well. But you need to make sure you're ready, because the rapture is any second of the day. I did a video yesterday talking about how the Jews are ready to build a thir third temple, already doing uh, mock Passover drills. And we're so close to the imminent rapture. And if you're left behind, you're going to be here for a hell on earth that this world gets shaken down to its core. In the box below the video title, I'm putting my Tribulation Survival Guide video. It tells you how to get saved in Tribulation and what to expect A to Z. Also, more importantly, I'm putting... The prayer to be saved by Jesus Christ's precious blood and six vital next steps to do. As soon as the video is over, do them because no one's guaranteed any more time in their life. If you'd like me to pray for you, contact me and I'll pray for you every day. And true Christians, keep witnessing and praying for the lost. If they won't listen, it's between them and God. But look up, our different draw nigh. We fly soon. Share this video with everybody you possibly can. Let's get the word out. Thanks.